Hello. Please hit like button and subscribe my channel. Also press bell icon for future video notifications. Thanks. November 10, 2022 at 2.14 p.m. Eastern Time Some eager Ford Bronco fans are still waiting to take delivery of their new SUV. This particular individual in Arizona doesn't have that problem. In fact, he decided to cut a new Bronco in half to make a custom matching trailer for his other Bronco. Don't send hate mail, however. This project has a very interesting backstory that involves Roush, Ford, and hardcore off-road testing. To start with, the donor Bronco for this trailer is one that nobody could buy. It was a two-door pre-production test vehicle slated for the scrapyard, where nearly all such machines end up. The mad scientist behind the trailer's creation is Darren who works for Roush at Ford's Arizona Proving Grounds. He's been involved in the 6G Bronco long before it went public, driving and wrenching on vehicles during testing. Specifically, he goes off-road with all the test vehicles, and he has a Bronco of his own as a support vehicle. Darren also has a lot of tools that go out on the trails, too many to fit in the back of his four-door Bronco. So he dialed up Ford to see about procuring a doomed test vehicle for a neat trailer project. He wanted a two-door model, as the rear quarter panels extend to the front of the rear wheels, making it a perfect candidate for a trailer conversion. Ford responded, and Darren got to work on what we believe is the first Gen 6 Bronco trailer in the world. This isn't simply half a Bronco with a trailer tongue welded to the front. To ensure it could handle extreme off-roading, he installed a trick hitch connector that swivels independently of the tow vehicle. It also rides on a custom suspension system of his own creation, incorporating airbags for adjustable ride height. The trailer frame is heavy steel tubing, with a 3 16 inch steel plate underneath to protect the gas tank. Yes. This Bronco trailer still has a factory tank that carries fuel wherever it's needed. It also still has the factory Bronco rear hubs and brakes, and the body connects to the frame on the stock rubber mounts. This significantly reduces vibration, and a solid steel front with steel support beams keeps the trailer rigid. Inside there's an aluminum skin for added strength and ease of storage leaving plenty of room for toolboxes and two onboard air compressors. According to the video, Darren built the trailer in just six weeks while working on other Ford projects. Considering all the fabrication that went into the trailer, we'd say the final product looks pretty darn good considering the short time frame. Source. Chase Gentry via YouTube. Thanks for watching. Credits to www.motor1.com and Spied Build LLC. Please subscribe my channel for more auto updates.